the idea is what happens and what I see a lot of is when riders get stuck on the hills and they stall the engine what they tend to do your immediate reaction is pulling that clutch and what happens then you start rolling back down mm -hmm. and it's a real shit feeling when you're rolling backwards down a hill <laughs> See like that, the engine's holding it quite well there. If you panic and grab that clutch, your front brake's gonna be useless, it's just gonna skid down. Obviously this hill is not super steep, it's like a good one to practice on. The steeper it is, there's always that factor the front wheel might come up, you know. So that's where you're going to have to start to practice to um, be able to control that front wheel when it comes up in the air. And that's just with the clutch. It comes up a little bit, a little bit of clutch. You never want to get it, to, you, you want to try and avoid it getting to that high point in any situation. So that's why your finger's always on the clutch. You know, I think it's also important to know where you're placing your foot, you know. If, you, if you're out on some of those hills and you're stuck, you know, look for where you can place your uh, foot because it's going to give you an advantage if it's a bit of a taller rock, actually boost off it. So even for the shorter guys, look for those high points, you know, that's going to make a difference. Um,